A tenant at the Sheepshead Bay Houses is asking for help. As she says, she's had barely any heat or hot water for the past two days. News 12's Julia Joseph went on over today to check out the situation. The warmth in Noreen Southworth's apartment can be felt from her hand-knit Christmas ornaments, but not her radiator. The 35-year tenant at Sheepshead Bay Houses has been complaining of inconsistent heat and hot water in her apartment for two days. And this is not just any two-day period. It includes the second coldest Christmas Eve on record that we've had in New York City. As a tenant of New York City Housing Authority, I would like to get what is re required of them to send. Decent amount of heat, not too much, not too little, and hot water. And why do I have to go to this extreme? It started when a tenant on the first floor of the building complained that her floors were burning hot. They have the radiators in the basement attached to the ceiling. And when they put the heat on, even if it's just lightly, She's like walking across a hot place. So to fix this, she tells me the building shut off her neighbor's line of heat, which also included her own. Now, normally with a heating system of heat risers and radiators, you feel the heat radiating off the two. But here in Noreen's apartment, you can touch these riser poles and the feeling of heat is quite minimal. Noreen put in a ticket request for management to turn back on her heat and hot water, but so far she's still having to keep warm with her space heater. I'm trying to keep warm. I don't want to get sick. Reporting from Sheep's Head, Julia Joseph, News 12. Now, we did reach out to New York City Housing Authority, and they said in part, NYCHA heat staff visited this unit and confirmed that there was heat present in all rooms. The bedroom temperatures were 78.2 degrees and 76 degrees, and the hot water temperature in the bathroom was 119.8 degrees, and in the kitchen, 120 degrees.